Got it? Sure. Okay. Uh, that's not good. I like ass. <laughs> round two. I forgot that. We'll be seven. back for round two. Round two. We'll be back. Find the correct menu here. There it is. All right. Ready? Missed. <laughs> All right, we'll wait for round two. For All right, tell us about Pi Flyer, Paul. So, after watching everything over the last few years, the one thing I uh, figured out is lighter is better. So uh, I stripped it down. Uh, Dale was like commenting, never seen a robot built on a perf board before. So. Awesome. Something, something new for Dale. Anyway, it's uh, kind of a combination of uh, some of the Pi Flyer mo or the Pi uh, three Pi motors. It's encoder driven. There's a uh, something unique uh, compared to most. I have an actual FPGA on here, doing all sorts of sensor manipulation, and there's some Excellent. other stuff that I'm adding later. So, anyway, uh, this particular one, I'm uh, trying to run as close to a circle as possible to kind of decrease speeds. So, all right. Okay. We look forward to it. Ready? See how it goes. A little bit. I noticed the a little bit of wheel skid there. Yeah. Yeah. Lost a little bit of traction. You know, if you'd have been a little bit heavier, maybe you had that traction you needed, right? <laughs> object if we move the arena a little bit further from the edge of the stage? <laughs> you object? Okay. Which edge? Yeah. <laughs> Which edge are you going to move from? We got time on that? Five seconds. Whole set of Pi team seconds. came together right. Right. and uh, built a series of robots as a team effort. Right. And uh, so these, this is uh, the evolution of that. So PS24. PS24. Does this one have inertial nav? No, this no. is just pure, simple timing. Timing and so you're just going with it. Right one of the things about the three pi robots yeah, is on that one. Uh, that they uh, they have a voltage regulator on the motors so that you can have reasonable expectation of it uh, going Let's at the same I'm speed. Moving, Unfortunately, PS twenty four missed one of the waypoints. Uh, missed, Hit, you hit the pylon. And I hit a pylon also. So hitting the pylon, unfortunately, is a disqualification. Right. If you miss a waypoint, however, and you still get back, there's just a penalty. So, but hitting so the pylon, unfortunately, I've is a DQ. I've got 25 also. So tell All right, me so we've got 25, PS25. Do you right now? Yeah, okay. you're okay. next in the line okay. here, so. Hopefully this one will do a little bit better. A little bit of tweaking and aiming there. Yeah, yeah, exactly, trying to sort of see if I can improve the this one half. Well, well, that's not doing right, much we better here. the pylon. Yeah. Oh, almost, not... almost a pylon killer there. Yeah. New, new competition. All right. <laughs> pylon killer. All right. All right thank you. Should have been. Sorry. No problem. I was waiting for Team Q. I have a laser alignment this year. Laser alignment, wow. Are we bouncing between competitions? Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Oh, some serious traction problems here. Um, really good run, uh, but maybe a little too aggressive on the acceleration, right? Yeah. <laughs> that helps. Plugging in the sensors. I've, I've done that, yeah. So it's interesting that nobody, one of the uh, one of the choices that you get to make in this is you can start well behind the line and get a running start. However, of course, when you do that, you're taking the risk of 
perhaps missing because you didn't oh, no. oh, a pylon strike. Oh, so close. So close. All right. Um, you, you want this one now? Oh! Okay, thank you. All right. Did not even realize I pushed the button. All right. I'm ready. Sorry about that. Okay, here we go. You didn't... St you stopped it when I crossed the line. But you didn't. I didn't, I've taken the penalty. I didn't make those. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm running again because he, he stopped the clock like way after I crossed okay, the line. Yeah, that's okay. You didn't do anything. You're going to have to do this again. Boom. You're going to have to do it again. <laughs> <laughs> All right, awesome. Should we be telling him about Calvary? What is that, a 10 second penalty for each of the two that you didn't? You I don't missed. remember what the rules say, but there's a penalty for each one I missed. I made, I made that one and I'm back. Okay. So you got Dr. Ted, uh, Paul, and then Dale. Lining up with a laser. Excellent. Did you steal that off your drill press? No, I bought it specifically for this robot from Adafruit. Oh. They have a selection of lasers if you're looking for one. Oh, man. So I'm DNF. DNF on the second. But listen, I don't think I'm going to beat my time. Oh! Yeah. Slow that puppy down. Nope. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, all right, here we go. Time is 5.39. For those unaware, uh, when I'm talking about inertial now, that is, uh, one of Clint's robots in previous years had um, a set of accelerometers and gyroscopes uh, on board that uh, you're still good to go. Got two and cross the line. We missed one. I missed one. Yeah, so the time is? 8.84. 8.84 and one 30 second penalty. 8.84 and 30 second penalty. That's awesome. And that was PS24 and now PS25. So, anyway, the combination of the accelerometers and gyroscopes and did it have magnetometers in it? Uh, no. Just Probably not. But anyway, uh, and. and do some pretty significant number crunching and you can figure out basically where you are by where you've been and how fast you've tried to get there. Uh, oh, and a miss. Yeah, I got caught right. up on the, uh, the tape. The guy, the, the, oh, yes. Yeah. Okay. Constructed of aluminum. Yeah. Uh, you have an Arduino Omega, is that correct? Yes. As the main controller and for motors. Um, it's a, uh, a motor driver from Pololu. Okay, one of the Pololu motor drivers. Are those the Pololu 37 millimeter gear motors? Uh, yes. yes. With, with encoders, right? Yeah, right. Excellent. Yay. Good, nicely done. 10.56. 10.56, a good time. Bikes in your wheels? <laughs> okay, next time I'll make sure to, like, uh, really yeah. tear up the cars. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, a little bit of wheel slip, but still made the made all the waypoints and crossed the line correctly. So, a little bit. Thank you. Excellent. What was the time? Five point five two. Five point five two. A very good time, Ted. Excellent. All right. 
Yeah. Is it the left lane or the right lane? Okay. Some of the time. <laughs> Tiger Woods evaluating the green. <laughs> Much closer, so much closer. Um, very disappointing to see. Because it's a four, Paul, it's a four-second run. Paul missed that. You're not going to do worse than mine. Made the corner. Oh! Cross over the line. <laughs> It is consistent. Yeah. 5.3. 5.3. This one likes that pylon, that's for sure. All right, it does. Okay, so this, that, that one really likes that pylon. All right, that was PS24 that was with the DNF. Yep. Okay. By the way, for the guys that are getting ready uh, for the next event, uh, the next event will be beacon finding over here on the floor. And while we're running beacon finding, the crew is going to be setting up line following. The crew. Uh oh. <laughs> you know what, you guys? All you guys with your fast, fancy robots. I'll tell you. <laughs>